Hi guys, I'm here to open up my spring FabFitFun box and um, I'm just gonna get right into it. I cut it open because it was covered in tape and it seems like it got a little um, beat up so we'll see what happens, but that's what it looks like. I know everything I'm getting. I'll just go through them with you. I can't remember them all, so I will uh, post more details as I go. Here's the magazine, the FabFitFun one. I'll leave that. Coupon, $15 off your first FabFitFun box. If anyone wants it, message me. I'll give you the code. Stickers. Let's get to it. Hello Fresh every time. Okay, here we go. So I have, um, this is one of my choices. Actually, <laughs> they're all my choices, but this is the Josie uh, Moran Whipped Argan Body Butter. And I've used her hair oils before and really... I really liked it. I just, it's basically yeah, just a bit a body butter, but I'm just gonna open it if I can tell you if there's any scent. Oh my gosh, it looks, look at this as I open it. This texture, I don't know if you can see. Oh, it smells like, um, like vacation, like papaya or what's in here? Oh, it doesn't say easily. Oh my gosh, it smells freaking amazing. <laughs> Ooh. Okay, I'm glad I got that. Next up is this, the Fenty Beauty. Now, I haven't tried anything by Fenty before. There was the Diamond Bomb, which I researched and I wanted to get first, but that um, basically sold out within, or was out of stock right away. I got there. Within 20 minutes, I'm an annual member. Didn't get it. So I got this one, and this is supposed to be a um, highlighter duo. It looks more like a blush in the photos, but in the sh it's in Kilowatt. Girl Next Door and Chic Freak. I mean, that's what it looks like. And that's what it looks like. Really pretty. I don't know if you can see. Really sparkly though, I'm wondering about, let me just swatch it for you so you can see. So that was the sparkly one. It's not bad at all, it's more peachy. I think this will look nice. So that was Chic Freak and this is Girl Next Door. They're kind of hard to see, yeah. So this one's very sparkly. I'm not, I don't like a lot of sparkle, but that might be good for an inner corner highlight or something like that. Side note, I know I said I was on a no buy for those of you that know me. Um, but I'd already paid for a year in advance of FabFitFun, so I was like, oh, I'll just pick all home goods, lifestyle stuff, whatever. I picked all skincare and makeup this time, and I've never done that, just because I didn't really like a lot of the other stuff. Um, next up is, oh, I forgot about this, are these, uh, never mind, I got earrings. I don't know what I'm saying. Kate Spade, they're like supposed to be like opalish earrings, um, and here they are, they're very sparkly. They retail for Canadian, I see right here. So 38 Canadian or 32 US. Come with a little cute. Um, like I've never got jewelry from, blah, blah, blah. never got jewelry before. Um, all right, and then next up is Hourglass, which is another product I haven't tried before. They've come out with these eyeshadows that are ridic ridiculously expensive that I would never get. So this one is a, like a lightning, a lighting blush, like illuminator, I guess. In the shade, um, I don't know if it's ambient or just says ambient strobe lighting blush. No, ir incandescent Electra. It's really um, shiny, it's hard to show you. But that's kind of, that's what it looks like. So I haven't really used anything like this before. I'm happy to swatch it though. Just a very light. Oh, this will be really pretty. Yep. Happy with that. Okay. Ooh. Sorry. And then the Kate Spade, Kate Spade bag. I forgot about this. There were so many choices that I just didn't want. And all the ones I wanted, limited stock went out really quickly. Um, I refreshed for a while to get this. I just think it's a really cute spring purse. 
I don't own any pink ones in my massive collection. Um, this one retails for 88 Canadian or 78 um, US. So it's really cute. I think it's the perfect little thing to hold for spring. So I was happy to get that. But I had to refresh so many times. First world problems. I had to refresh so many times to do it. Um, and I feel that if they had, they should have more stock if they're going to, they're going to, you know, put it in the box or advertise it. But they did say it was limited edition. Anyways, I did call Fab Fit Fun. One second, one more thing. Earth Harbor Glow Juice. I recently did PR for Earth Harbor, and they have amazing stuff like their Sunshine Sunshine Dew Cleansing Balm, their Eclipse Sunscreen. So good. Sovereign Silk Moisturizer, amazing. So I really wanted to try this. So it's a um, refining enzyme mask with seaweed and fruit enzymes. Oh, it's more jelly-like. Just so you can see. It smells like... It smells refreshing. I know I'm going to love it because I love all their stuff. Okay, so... Leaked all over me. So that's what I ended up getting. What I'll do is I'll post the swatches and everything else on my Instagram, Bottom of the Box Beauty. Just wanted to add something else. Actually, I'll just go over it. So I got that for skincare, I got the body butter and the enzyme scrub. Makeup wise, the um, highlighter blush thing and then the illuminating blush, kind of similar. Uh, and then I also, then I got the purse from Kate Spade and the earring. So I will, I'll run up all the totals and then I'll uh, let you know. Um, I'm gonna try these on now just so you can kind of see what they look like. So the other thing I was gonna say is that I was kind of annoyed with choice and how the only things I really wanted I couldn't get. So I told them I, I wanted to cancel because it happened last time too um, with some canisters, but I'm not gonna open that canister again. Anyways. Um, so they said, okay, we'll send you a mystery bag if you stay signed up. And, oh, look how pretty that is. So I said, sure. Why not? I, um, see how it goes. So they sent me this um, from, what's it called? It came separately, but I just held it to the side. The Bathologist Sleep Lavender and Fresh Mint. So I needed bath scrub anyway, and I'm, I'm happy to get that. They also sent me an Illamasqua. Illamasqua. I'm sorry if I pronounce it wrong. A lipstick in the shade, so it's Rocket Antimatter Lipstick, and it is um, a nice red lipstick, so I'll just show it to you there. So it's a nice, more of a cool toned, I think, red, which I think would look really nice on. I'm already wearing like a... Mm, that's really nice. I'm already wearing something and was wearing something already, so it might look different. The other thing they sent me was this necklace, which I know maybe it's cute. I just don't think I would wear it. Um, you can kind of see it just got like these flowers on it. So, so that's what I ended up getting. Let me know what you got, what you think. And like I said, check out my Instagram, Bottom of the Box Beauty, and I'll just be posting like a photo of all the stuff I've got with the retail prices, what it's all worth, what the swatches look like, um, that kind of stuff. So take a look there. Thanks for watching.